As results come in, Japanese politics are taking a marked shift to the right, bringing this man, a former Prime Minister, Shinzo Abe, back into the spotlight. Expected to become his country's eighth Prime Minister in just over six years, his conservative LDP party is predicted to take two-thirds of the seats in Japan's lower house in conjunction with a junior coalition partner. So I think people uh, probably came back to the the party they were familiar with. And also I think uh, the, I'd like to point out that uh, LDP is uh, the old uh, party has a tradition. For many voters across Japan, it was the state of the economy that influenced them at the polling stations. Restoring the economy is the most important issue, this voter told us, and the LDP can be trusted to do that. This woman also voted LDP. The country must stand up for itself and be strong, she said, echoing the views of many in Japan that the LDP will restore national pride. This election is a dramatic defeat for Prime Minister Yoshihiko Noda, who announced his resignation, with his Democratic Party of Japan likely to lose two-thirds of their seats. And emerging as a major force in national politics, the outspoken nationalist Shintaro Ishihara's Japan Restoration Party is predicted to become the third largest. Conservative and nationalist candidates have been helped in this election by recent spats between Japan and its Asian neighbours, China in particular. The question now is will they back up tough talk with tough action once in office? Rob McBride, Al Jazeera, Tokyo.